another pre-spawn area. I'm gonna fish this. This is gonna be our last spot of the day, guys. We are gonna start out We're gonna start out the same way I always do. Ooh, I see the. That looks like rain right there. Hopefully we can fish it. It's 120, 120 right now. This is gonna be our last spot. Tons of current out here today, guys. So you no problem, no problem. We're not really fishing in the current, so this ain't gonna be in that current anyways. Same way, I'm gonna go in here a little bit. See what's going on. See what the temperature of this creek is. Fifty. Fifty degrees. This creek here is fifty degrees. So how cold it's been the last couple of nights? Thirty degrees. It has a devastating effect on the creeks. Creek temperatures go down very quick. I'm only gonna go up a fish's tree. All right, I crank baited this bank. No bites. I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna Ned rig that side. Some of these trees. Now the point of me doing this is just to see if the fish have come out, come out right there and has moved anywhere in here on these trees. They may have moved in here last week, but since the temperature's gone down so low, drop these temperatures, the water temperatures in these creeks, they've kind of they're like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Kind of move back out. There's somebody up shallow. the best notice where I caught him at at the same type of areas really close to the really close to the channel keep fishing this a little bit yo <laughs> pulled him right out of that tree <laughs> my pole goes Ding! It's like, oh, he come out. <laughs> Look at them red eyes. Well, orange eyes. Guys, hey, I'm on a diet too. Look, it's getting down a little bit. It's gonna take a little bit, a couple more weeks before I get down. Y'all start calling me jumbo sticks out here, huh? <laughs> I wonder if they're shallow right here on these rocks. Let's find out. Let's find out if anybody's sitting over here on these rocks. Boom! Over there. Oh my gosh. It is a freaking giant, dude. Stay down. Stay down. Don't come off. Don't come off. Don't come off. Oh my gosh. It's a huge fish. Look at my pole dancing, dude. Don't come out. Stay down. Stay down. I'm not ready for you yet. It's a huge fish. It's another huge smallmouth, guys. 
It's a huge smiley. Oh. <sighs> baby, baby. Oh, now you know you're hooked, huh? She swam right to me, dude. Dude, is that another tank or what? Dude. Dude, is this a smash fest? I'm gonna include all this in my video, how I picked this little area apart. Caught this fish. Beautiful female Somali. That's number two for the day. Now this one is not near as big as the other one. The other one's four pounds, two ounces. This one's close to three, about three pounds. But still, beautiful smallmouth. Thank you, girl. Yes. Sitting about a foot of water. We're right there. Right there. See heavy, heavy currents right there. She's sitting right there. Just right on the edge of that current. And there's actually current coming out of here. So what I think is doing is I think that there might be some more fish stacked right here. I don't know. I'll go. They were fixing to find out. <sighs> oh, baby. What a day. Let's take your time. Figure out what the fish are doing, man. Kind of. You can kind of start honing in on where the big fish are sitting. You know what I'm saying? Like. The first big smallmouth I caught, what did I catch her on? A crankbait, shallow on a point with rocks. This smallmouth, what did I catch her on? Same thing, a big spotted bass. He, he was actually caught on the shaky head, but he was on a point too. Fish every 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 foot i'm throwing it every foot fan casting hitting all these rocks down there and the fish that keep eye on your line make sure you don't get no nicks in it right down through there might have to retie one or two times doing this be easier retying than losing your lure and a and a five pounder Them, Keep fishing them. Uh-oh. Rut row. Look, came off. There's a fish on there. What the what the heck? What the heck, dude? I was hung on the bottom, dude. Dude, I was hung on the bottom. And <laughs> I don't know if it came off and he hit it or if he was on there the whole time and got me off, got me unhung. Freaking hilarious, dude. <laughs> My drop shot, dude. Breaking it out, boys. Breaking out the drop shot. Let's see who's out here. find them dude let's find these bassasauruses oh, there's a fish over there Nice one. Let me tighten this drag up a little bit. Yeah, it is a nice spotted bass. There we go. Come here. Come here, buddy. There we go. Nice spotted bass on the drop shot. 
dude, we're gonna catch them on everything today. Drop shot, shaky head, crankbait. What else we gonna use? Huh? What else y'all want to use to catch fish on today? <laughs> shaky head. <laughs> Look at that freaking chunk. <laughs> Guys. A nice chunker caught him on the drop shot out here hey we've caught him on crankbait uh crankbait ned rig shaky head drop shot what else that's it so far nice one a drop shot i'm using a, the same color it's called the deal the deal as my ned rig but it's a minnow pattern instead of a kind of like a crawfish pattern caught him on this other side right next to the channel well, could be school of them over there i don't know it's a barge we passed earlier he's just now catching the barge we passed earlier he's just now catching up to us Oh yeah, I also want to tell you, look, see how my boat's pushing out? When big, big barges come by, they kind of suck the water out and they produce a lot of current for like just a couple minutes. It also triggers the fish to bite. Gives them a little more oxygen in the water. Well, sometimes they just turn on for a few seconds. Oh! Yes, they do. I don't know. That's another good one. Oh, he got off. Yeah. Maybe they'll trigger. <laughs> Sometimes they'll trigger, man. They'll come up. Come up shallow and just start eating fish. Going crazy for a couple minutes. There was another one. There's one. It feels good, dude. Don't jump. Don't jump. Don't jump. Don't jump. Come here, buddy. There we go. Go guys, another nice one. Them orange eyes, pretty cool, ain't it? There you go, another nice mama. I mean, spotted bass. Look at them orange eyes, dude. He's watching y'all. Look. Mm -hmm. Dude, if there was a tournament today out here, we'd be in the money for sure. We're sitting in. Boat sitting at 15. I'm throwing it in about two and a half and I'm dragging it all the way out to about uh, about 10 foot. And it seems like I'm getting bites right in about the five foot area. I don't think that's a bass. Yeah, that's a bass. It's not a big one. There we go. Thanks, little friend. We're going to switch a net rig right there. Same color. What's up? Well, there's a big female down there. That's why they're sitting down there. That's what I'm what I'm wondering I'm wondering why they're all stacked right there in shallows unless there's a big old female big old fat hog head female sitting down there <laughs> I 
What else? Oh crap, there was one. Oh man, I wasn't even ready for that. Hang on, I was gonna throw my shaky head down there on them. Shaky head. Come on, shaky. Shake it. Shake it, shake it. Shake your head, shake your head. Oh, almost got him. Almost got him. Now the current's pushing in. I showed y'all a while ago the current was pushing out. Now the current's pushing in. Oh my God, it's a bliss. Holy guacamoles. Freaking monster, dude. Freaking monster down there, dude. Oh, big boat slowed down for me. Appreciate it. Usually they don't ever slow down. Well, I need to check this radar real quick. Let me see how close this rain is, Timmy. It is... Oh my God. Where is that? Jackson, it's in Jackson, Tennessee. I'm the blue dot. That's at one o'clock, 1.40. Oh, it's almost at me. It's almost here, guys. I gotta go. We gotta go. We got to haul it back. No, I ain't joking. This is gonna be a no joke ride right here, boys. Holy crap. Oh! And that boat didn't slow down for me. Thanks a lot, you little sorry sucker. All right, guys, hey. Got a call today. Back here in the background, radar showed rain coming in. It's about 30 minutes out. I'm about 20 minutes away from the ramp. So we got a jet. So thanks for watching guys. Give me a thumbs up. And subscribe to the channel. Hey, subscribe to the channel. Appreciate y'all guys.